Hey, what's up, guys? And this is a cool video I got for you today. This is the variant four, I believe, the tech variant of uh, final boss. Um, I was, uh, this is the junior account, obviously, and um, yeah, this variant basically is it. If you're not tech, you do fifty percent less damage. That's pretty much it. That's the whole global. So you know, guild twenty ninety nine. Glad I have her on the roster. So basically, with this fight. Uh, you want to bring a guillotine and ramp her up because the, this fight what the note I didn't know if she was gonna have the reach for it. I it was actually curious I don't know how far I was gonna make it my plan was if I did die with her Just bring an archangel and just use him until he dies But um, basically what this fight is is selective time stream. That's like pretty much the only really node you need to worry about Which basically is every 20 seconds. He will regen to full Okay, he'll take off all debuffs on him and regenerate to full um, this can be stopped with like passive heal blocks like Warlock and Archangel's Neurotoxins, so that's why I was bringing him. And it can be stopped if you have a Shock or Incinerate on the opponent. But I don't really have any good characters on my roster that have Shock or Incinerate. Um, so the other strat that you can do that I did in my main account years ago with Star Lord as a five star is out damage him. Basically, take him down 400,000 health, I think he has around there in 20 seconds so in order to do this obviously with that being said you need to have some massive damage output to do 400,000 damage in 20 seconds and this is a four star character so i really had no idea if she would have the reach or not because i think her damage caps out at 600 hits on the combo meter and um right now we're at 200 hits and we're getting like a good 15 20 percent off on a good run so I was like, I really don't know. We're gonna see, we're gonna see. I don't know exactly how, if I can out damage 400,000 health, but Guillotine, as you know, her ramp up is very sexy. I mean, most characters do not last 600 hits with Guillotine 2099, like at any star level, even like a three star. Um, nothing really survives to 600 hits, unless it's a very special fight like this, or they have a crazy amount of health. But um, yeah, this guy, Kang, uh, with his heal, he's one of the few bot fights in the game that can even let Guillotine get ramped up this far. But I think at this point we're doing what four thousand energy damage a second every hit. Um, we're doing a bonus four k damage, so a full combo is like twenty k, twenty two k from our basics. Also, a little bit, I don't know, somewhere around that range. And I'm like, listen, we're almost three hundred in, and we're not really making that much headway. Um, but what am I gonna do? Just keep trying. I'll see. Worst comes to worst, I can't finish the fight in one run. I'll do as much damage as I can do, and then before he heals up, I'll leave the fight and then bring an Archangel. That was my plan. But I recorded this just in case I get the one-shot. Um, and obviously, it has to be a one-shot guillotine, because if I were to die with her, I, I could bring her in again, but it would be an extra 100 hits, and I just, I just don't want to do that. But it probably could be possible if I revived her, but you really just don't want to have to die. You want to get the special three in the fight before... And you want to make sure this is on your first try, you one-shot it. It'll make life a lot easier. One thing to also worry about is um, when his timer goes down, okay, and he takes off all debuffs on him, one thing to keep in mind is if you are doing this fight yourself, that includes your parry stun. So if you parry, and then right before you hit him, he shrugs it off because the timer went out, he can counter you. So you just got to be make sure of that. Just make sure you don't, you're not, like, stunning him or on parries before the thing happens. Also, you're going to see in this fight, um, Kang Special 1, thank God, is super easy and fast to dodge. So I don't think I parry pretty much at all in this fight, except for maybe like a few times. But like, it's so easy to just keep him against the wall um, and just backdraft only. So it's very sexy. Uh, at this point now, on a good run, we're doing close to like 40, 50% of his health um, in the 120 second margin. I think right there, I couldn't tell. Sony Vegas is kind of... Um, the fr it looks like the quality is really bad for me, so I can't really tell. But I think that run I might have gotten him to 50% or under or very close to it. Um, so now we're doing now we're breaking 50%. We're at 400 hits, which is really like 300 hits only because we start the fight with 100. So all right now we're at the damage where we can break 50% health in one run. So I'm thinking, okay, um, we might be able to do this. Every one of our hits is doing 8,000 damage, so a five combo is 40,000 damage, which is crazy. So basically what that means is um, we need to have uh, 50 hits at that damage level in 20 seconds, which isn't really that doable. So we got to hit him a little bit more. 
Now we're getting him even lower. He's at like 40%, 30%. See, right there I parried, but I didn't go in because I realized that it was, he was about to shrug it off, which was smart on my part. Um, his special one stuns, so if it were to hit you, you could just lose all your damage. I have my combo shields built up. I think I get hit at one point in this fight by like a random heavy attack he just decides to throw, but we'll see when we get there. We're almost at the point now where each one of our hits is doing close to 10,000 damage. We're almost there. We're at like 9.7 right now. But um, yeah, we're very close to a full combo being 50,000, which means you only need 8 combos uh, to do 400,000. Um, now we're going to throw a special 2. We're about to pass the 500 hit mark. Now we're over 10,000 energy damage a hit. It's really beautiful. We're going to get him down to like 25% at this point on one single 20 second duration. Going in, keep scaling higher and higher. And I think the next cycle might be the one where we kill him in. Not this one, but maybe the next one. Or maybe the one after next. I think I try to line it up. Um, I think I get hit. I get hit very soon, I know. Oh, yeah, right there. See, he shrugs off my stun, like I told you, when it has a timer. And it caught me off guard, and he just instantly paired me. Pushed me to special three, so I just threw it. I was like, let me get this thing out. Um... And I think the cycle after this one is the one where I make it. Um, yeah, the next cycle is the one that I beat him on. I'm pretty sure. I'm close to the point we're doing, I think we're doing 11,000 energy. To, yeah, we're doing 11,000, close to like 500, almost 12k a hit. Now this next cycle, pay attention, because you're about to see 400,000 damage in a cycle. Okay, 400,000 damage in 20 seconds. You know who has damage like that? Kill 2099, best character in the game. Beyond God tier, 100%. Throw a special one. We go in. He's doing 12k energy damage per second. Just so thick. We get very close, and I think I end it with a special one. Yeah, we just get it. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Go to like, comment, subscribe, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.